Hey everyone, Cali Gold here again. Just to finish up the series on uh, Imperial Crafting Delivery, I'm going to uh, take some pickled vegetables, which I talked about in the last video. I'm going to make some crates with it through the Venusal set processing from storage. And then we're going to deliver some crates to the NPC just to wrap things up here. Because I am using the Venusal set, we're going to process from storage. The big thing, the big takeaway for this is you're going to do Imperial Cuisine, and then you're just going to right click on the pickle vegetables and then do Start. And we'll start making the crates. Once we make some crates, we're going to go ahead and make the delivery over to the Imperial Crafting NPC. The big thing we're doing here with the pickle vegetables, why we chose that, I talked about in the last video. But we're going to be turning this in every day. It's giving us cooking experience to make all this stuff. But we're turning it in for silver at professional level because that's our current level. Or the level we are going to be trading at until Guru. The other thing is we're getting seals for the trade. The seals is what we're going to be using to purchase the Supreme Cooking Machines. Which have 5,000 ticks in them. So we will continue through this loop until we get to Guru Cooking. And then for me personally, like I already stated, we're going to be doing Balenos meals. That it looks like for me they're going to be the easiest to do at Guru Cooking. Then we are going to be making a lot of those. And that should be a pretty decent silver gain in addition to seals. There's other stuff you can buy with those seals. When we do get to Guru and I start really working on that stuff, I'll make another quick video showing, like, was it all worth it? Was it all worth it to do this stuff? How much am I making? What's happening? Okay, so that's the process of making the boxes. So I'm just going to go in here and take, do I have enough to deliver? Here's 13. Let's just grab a few more that I already made yesterday. So grab 50. You can do like up to your weight limit. If, if you're overweight, you won't be able to deliver any of the boxes. So just keep it under your weight or you can, for me, I've got polar bears, Hercules gear, if I really want to increase the weight. And I'm using the Shy, which has a natural affinity to weight carry. So Imperial Crafting Delivery, let's just interact here. And we're going to go Imperial Crafting. And up oh, before I do that, let's make sure we have as much mastery as possible. So I'm going to slot some stuff and make sure I have mastery on stuff like that. So we got as much mastery as possible for cooking because you'll get more profit by having that. So here it is over here, professional cooking box, and we're just going to do sell all. Sell all, done. And over here on the left, you could see daily delivery quantity. Uh, you could do up to half of your CP. So the more CP you have, the more you'll be able to deliver every day. You can't just deliver everything, infinite amounts for this thing. You could do half of your CP daily on this. Uh, so like I said, we're a professional cooking. The goal eventually is to get to Guru. Let's take a quick look at the exchange just to kind of wrap that up. For now, I'm just taking every 500 seals or whatever, I stack them, and then I can buy Supreme Cooking Utensils. So there's your there's your cooking machine if you want, if you've got a you cooking utensil in your house that you don't want to move, you can purchase repair kits using the Supreme Cooking Machine. Repair kits from this guy here and then use the repair kit to repair the Supreme machine that's in your house. So that should be kind of the final thing here until I get to Guru. When I get to Guru, we'll do more. I'll make observations, and then we'll make one more final video on Imperial Crafting Delivery to kind of wrap it up. But we gotta wait till I get to Guru cooking on my character. Thanks guys, have a great day.